Well, hello everyone. This is Dr. Rufus Jones, music director at Gulliver Preparatory, and I am here to present to you uh, our first and what I hope will be our last virtual concert. As you all know, uh, we have all had to deal with the change in terms of how we teach, uh, moving from in-person instruction to remote teaching and remote learning. That has been especially challenging for the music ensembles because it is very difficult to do the same or even close to the same things that we would do in person in remote. And so one of the opportunities that I had and many of my colleagues had over the spring break uh, was to try to find different ways that we could continue to engage our students and continue to give them hope that music ensemble playing and performance and rehearsing and connecting through music could continue while although not being the same but that it could continue and so um, I found out about a number of performances that were popping up during the spring break uh, that we were calling virtual performances and I thought it would be great but I understood that there would be in the traditional sense trying to pull everyone together using the technology that we have Zoom in particular, and having everyone play or sing at the same time and record would not work because of the latency issue. And so as I began to investigate more about how this all could work, I, I got really excited because even though I knew the work was going to be involved, it's gonna require a lot of work to pull this together, that it was more than doable. It was just important for me uh, to find uh, some incredible students who are a great deal more tech savvy than I am to take on this work. And so I'm so grateful to Jason Filer uh, and Emma Grace uh, Devalar uh, for coming together and saying, listen, Dr. J, we, we really want to make this happen. Uh, what do we need to do? And so I started the process of kind of just step by step in terms of what I wanted each student to prepare, the piece that I wanted them to perform, how they would go about submitting the work, and that Jason and Emma Grace would go and do their magic and sync everything together. Now, just to give you a, a sense of what that's, uh, what's involved, uh, each student um, had to prepare a video presentation that they would submit. Uh, and that would essentially be done uh, by them listening to what we call a guide track and playing or singing along with that while they're recording. Once they submitted that uh, to Jason and Emma Grace, Jason and Emma Grace then would go about the process of syncing and balancing uh, everything so that we could come together uh, almost in the way that we would uh, in our natural uh, environment. I want to thank them again because I, I actually won't be able to thank them enough because, um, as I said before, this is a major, this was a major endeavor and they did a beautiful job. I had the opportunity to watch uh, and listen to uh, the end result and I'm excited and I know that you will be excited. So without further ado, I would like to turn it over to our wonderful ensemble. Thank you, all of our ensembles. Thank you to all of my students for the hard work that you've put into this. Um, this will be something we will be able to look back and say, even though something happened that changed our lives forever, music is the way to keep us going. Music will never stop. Music making will never stop. And you have proven that today. And everyone will be able to see the hard work that you have put in to this incredible project. Thank you all for your support. Have a great summer. And my students, I am hopeful that we will see each other face to face in person very soon. Be blessed. Come hear the music which rings as a home to you. 
to the nations. Celebrate, 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 celebrate,